How to tell if you have a bad vehicle speed sensor. A vehicle speed sensor, VSS, is a sensor that measures the speed of a vehicle's wheels and sends that information to the vehicle's computer. The computer uses this information to control various systems, such as the transmission, cruise control, and anti-lock brakes. The vehicle speed sensor can be located on the transmission or on the wheel hub, depending on the vehicle. It is an important component in ensuring the safe and efficient operation of a vehicle. The vehicle speed sensor works by using a magnetic or optical sensor to detect the rotation of the vehicle's wheels. As the wheels turn, the sensor sends a signal to the computer indicating the speed of the vehicle. The computer then uses this information to adjust various systems in the vehicle, such as shifting gears in the transmission or adjusting the speed of the cruise control. If the vehicle speed sensor fails, it can cause a number of problems with the vehicle systems. For example, if the vehicle speed sensor fails while driving, the transmission may not shift properly, the cruise control may not work, and the anti-lock brakes may not function correctly. This can lead to unsafe driving conditions and potential accidents. To diagnose a faulty vehicle speed sensor, a mechanic will typically use a diagnostic tool to check for error codes in the vehicle's computer. If a fault is detected with the vehicle speed sensor, it will need to be replaced. Overall, the vehicle speed sensor is an important component in ensuring the safe and efficient operation of a vehicle. Regular maintenance and replacement of faulty sensors can help prevent accidents and keep vehicles running smoothly. How to tell if you have a bad vehicle speed sensor? There are several signs that can indicate a faulty vehicle speed sensor, including 1. Speedometer not working. If the speedometer on your vehicle stops working or is inaccurate, it may be a sign of a bad vehicle speed sensor. In addition to the speedometer not working at all, a bad vehicle speed sensor can also cause erratic or fluctuating readings on the speedometer. 2. Check engine light. A faulty vehicle speed sensor can trigger the check engine light on your dashboard. This is because the sensor is connected to the vehicle's computer, which will detect any issues with the sensor. 3. Harsh shifting and similar transmission shifting problems. A bad vehicle speed sensor can cause problems with the transmission, such as delayed or rough shifting. A faulty vehicle speed sensor can cause the transmission to shift harshly or abruptly, which can be felt as a jolt or jerk when driving. 4. Cruise control not working. The vehicle speed sensor is also responsible for controlling the cruise control system in your vehicle. If the cruise control stops working, it may be a sign of a faulty sensor. 5. ABS light on. The anti-lock braking system, ABS, uses information from the vehicle speed sensor to operate correctly. If the ABS light on your dashboard comes on, it may be due to a bad vehicle speed sensor. 6. Stalling or hesitation. A malfunctioning vehicle speed sensor can cause the engine to stall or hesitate when accelerating or cruising at a steady speed. 8. Poor fuel economy. If the vehicle speed sensor is not functioning properly, it can cause the engine to work harder than necessary, resulting in decreased fuel efficiency. If you notice any of these signs, it's important to have your vehicle inspected by a qualified mechanic as soon as possible. What causes vehicle speed sensor failure? There are several factors that can contribute to vehicle speed sensor failure, including 1. Wear and tear. Like any other mechanical component, the vehicle speed sensor can wear out over time due to constant use and exposure to the elements. 2. Electrical issues, problems with the wiring or connections to the vehicle speed sensor can cause it to malfunction or fail altogether. 5. Faulty installation, if the vehicle speed sensor was not installed correctly or was installed with the wrong type of sensor, it may not function properly and could fail prematurely. 6. Corrosion, exposure to moisture and salt can cause corrosion on the vehicle speed sensor, leading to failure. 7. Malfunctioning speedometer. If the speedometer is not functioning properly, it can put extra strain on the vehicle speed sensor and cause it to fail. 8. Overheating. 
if the vehicle's engine or transmission overheats, it can damage the vehicle speed sensor and cause it to fail. 9. Manufacturer defects. In rare cases, a faulty vehicle speed sensor may be the result of a manufacturing defect. 10. Sensor location. If the vehicle speed sensor is located in an area where it is prone to damage or exposure, it may fail more frequently than sensors in better protected locations. How to care for vehicle speed sensor 1. Regular maintenance. Regular maintenance of the vehicle can help prevent the vehicle speed sensor from failing prematurely. This includes changing the transmission fluid and keeping the engine and transmission clean. Two. Avoid exposure to moisture and salt. If possible, avoid driving in areas where the vehicle is exposed to moisture and salt, as this can lead to corrosion on the vehicle speed sensor. 3. Check for malfunctioning speedometer. If the speedometer is not functioning properly, have it checked and repaired as soon as possible to prevent extra strain on the vehicle speed sensor. 4. Avoid overheating. Take steps to prevent the engine or transmission from overheating, such as ensuring proper coolant levels and avoiding heavy loads or extended idling. 5. Check for manufacturer recalls. Check with the vehicle manufacturer to see if there are any recalls or known issues with the vehicle speed sensor, and have them addressed if necessary. 6. Protect the sensor location. If possible, protect the vehicle speed sensor by placing it in a location that is less prone to damage or exposure. 7. Use high-quality parts. When replacing the vehicle speed sensor, use high-quality parts that are recommended by the manufacturer to ensure proper function and longevity. 8. Avoid harsh driving conditions. Avoid harsh driving conditions such as rapid acceleration, sudden stops, and rough terrain, as this can put extra strain on the vehicle speed sensor. 9. Monitor warning lights. If the check engine light or other warning lights come on, have the vehicle checked by a professional mechanic to diagnose any potential issues with the vehicle speed sensor. 10. Drive responsibly. Finally, drive responsibly and avoid reckless driving behaviors that can put unnecessary stress on the vehicle's components, including the vehicle speed sensor. By doing this simple precautionary steps, you can prolong the service life of your vehicle speed sensor. That's all we have for you in today's video. It's very good to have you here on our channel. If you like the video, please smash the like button and do consider subscribing if you haven't already. We hope to see you soon with another video, until then, stay safe.